you guys in today's video i'm gonna show you all my oops <laughs> my red ink in my collection so these are all what i have in bottled inks in in the red deep red shade and but at the end of the video we can also you can also select with me what is our favorite red ink would be this is already <laughs> covered with spillage so So, because I've had good um, views with my red, I mean, sorry, my green and my browns, next to, next biggest shade in my collection are reds. So, I think this would be the last because I don't have any other color category that has um, around 10, 11 bottles. So, yeah, let us swatch it out and... I have an ink journal here, the Galen Leather um, journal, I mean, Tomo River paper. So this was my green. And I all actually had a comment that I should have shown all the inks. So yeah, next time. <laughs> so this is now um, the browns as well. So I'm planning to look at them in one go. Like I do have a ink journal before with all the bottles but they were like brand wise this time it's gonna be shade wise okay so let us enjoy and swatch with me let me just label this um red ink collection okay. okay let's just use my kakimori nib to swatch each and every ink that i have here so this is in no particular order guys i'm just gonna have to i think we'll do the noodlers last these two because they are very like almost permanent okay let's do the ox blood i know i've just recently swatched this but yes let's try again is it close enough okay so this is the diamine ox blood I'm really sorry with the noise because there is no time of the day <laughs> that they will quiet down it's also evening and that is my family kids time so that is our ox blood okay so i'm not writing dates anymore when i accumulate this it's been so long autumn oak i actually have more of diamine ink guys but how about you do you also have a favorite brand Oh, this is a bit of really autumn. This is autumn oak. I just categorized these two reds because the red is still um, dominating the shade. Okay. Very autumn. 
let me know if you also have your favorite red in the comments okay that's it oh well, this is done and this is done moving on again another diamond oh, i think this is also like a bit of the orange let's with go with the red dragon forgot to write diamond <laughs> goodness okay there's no right or wrong in swatching guys there's no you cannot really say like originality because everyone is getting inspiration from everyone so yeah it's our community here you cannot just say oh she got that from that everything is open open book okay this is diamine red dragon to me this is more of a christmas red okay so that's our red dragon that's done next is okay we'll have this ancient copper do you enjoy this ink swatching videos guys because i also like it i also like to want to binge watch everybody's <laughs> inking session <laughs> while i work so yeah so this is ancient copper again you will have a very annoying construction noise background diamond ancient one of my very first favorites because of adventure denali who doesn't know her you can check her account Actually, she just um, she's busy with knitting right now <laughs> before I used to like look up for her videos pen and ink videos so I hope she'll go back to this again okay that's done and uh, last on my list of diamond is writer's blood which is also the newest I hope you've seen my comparison between the two if you are into reds and burgundies okay. I like my kakimori okay so this is the diamond very very dark writer's blood I have this in my August ink if you haven't watched yet. Okay. Just get used to my annoying sound. <laughs> okay, that's our Diamond Writer's Blood. And our sixth ink six is let's try this vinta cicatuna my one and only bottle and surprisingly it's almost half ink oh god they have these granules excuse me don't ruin my <laughs> my spread you vinta some dried out inks became powdery so yeah let's check i believe this have a very strong sheen to it okay surprisingly this is looking like red let's wait till it dries binta cicatuna this has all um if you're not familiar with the meanings of the names you can head on to kikai crafts channel she 
explain it better. She's also a Filipina based in Jakarta. So she likes to tell the stories of this Vinta inks. Very, very informative. Okay, that's the Vinta Sikatuna. So we are now in our seventh bottle. Let's check. Okay, this is the Arbonne Parfum Rose and Enric Rogue. God knows what the correct pronunciation, but yes, Arbonne. This is also scented ink. So if you're a fan of, but it won't last any scent that I know. It's just when you open the bottle and you can smell your paper with it, but it doesn't really stay the, the scent when it's dried. So yeah. Very, very, what is this? Yeah. Let me find my word. <laughs> Urban I love this. This is a free ink I got from um handwritten pen shop before when I bought my one of my grail pen. I forgot which one. Okay. So this is more of really like a rosy red. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Valentine, very Valentine red. Okay. Dry test so far. Mm, so my Vinta Sikatuna has become green now. <laughs> I will show you guys the up close. Three more. Okay. Now we'll go to this. I think cola, the Atramentis cola ink. Again, another scented, scented. This smells like real, like, as per the name, Coca-Cola. But it won't last. Like I said, see, very cola. If you can recall, we have all those candies that's cola flavored. It's much more smell like that. When we are, who's 90s here? <laughs> 90s kids Lisa Frank moments so this is the yeah let's just throw in some ink first it's very thick to write with this the atra I got this ink information that it's scented and it's really your favorite um pen and teas the atramentis cola so she likes this and i was very curious as well so yeah this has a bit of a brown undertone i'm not sure let's see okay now to one of the most uh, one of my favorite as well is the Mm, black cherry i forgot yeah this is from private reserve if i'm not mistaken and it's very difficult to open this kind of bottle and it's still leaked so yeah ha, ha, ha. Life. So, life when you get a freebie, you can complain. <laughs> Again, from Handwritten Pen Shop. This is one of my favorite to match with my... Which pen? I forgot. Um, before my Sakura. So, this is Private Reserve. Black. Correct me if I'm wrong, because the name is already covered, so yeah. Okay, so my 
background noise is also a hit or miss <laughs> if I take a break from filming that's the time they will also be quiet can you imagine my fate guys <laughs> and second to the last is our actually I'm in doubt if this is red what do you think guys for Yamabudo to me this is this falls in the purple um, category yeah yes so let me just leave that at the moment and let's do the Australian roses black swan in Australian roses by Noodlers Inc so the Yamabudo will be in our purples everybody knows Yamabudo correct it's one of the most popular pilot pen, um, ink sorry so this is the black swan this is also my favorite winter color I, I will be inking this I will be using them soon long name is Noodler Soap yeah. okay that's it let's keep Yamabudu actually Yamabudu is very similar to this but I'll just put it in the violets or purple categories so right now this is our reds in my collection total of 10 bottles so Vinta Cicatuna from red, there's a sheen of really like glittery shimmery green there. So it's standing out as not as red. <laughs> Funny. Anyway, yeah. So my favorite of all is -da 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 -da, I think I'm still very much into the ox blood i don't know why i know writer's blood is my newest but they still tap it up <laughs> ox blood if i see it all in one uh, spread but if you ask me to compare this both for my pilot elite i chose the writer's blood and for my least least favorite i guess um, it would be the Vinta just because it's not actually a red when it's dried so we are in our red category at the moment yeah so let's just keep it two reds so that's it guys I'm just doing a quick outro <laughs> my phone is dying and uh, yes so let me know which one is your favorite and your least as well and if you do have the same ink collection like i do that's it guys i'll see you on my next one don't forget to like and subscribe bye